children today our new topic is from history portion that is buildings paintings and books the architecture books and paintings of ancient india provide us with us lot of information of those times it helps us to understand traditions customs and lifestyles followed by the inhabitants let's discuss it in detail architecture was an important part of ancient india it helps us to know about the accomplishment with regard to structural engineering and artistry of those times especially during and after the rise of buddhism and jainism the skills of our craft person are also apparent in the buildings that have survived such as stupas the word stupa means a mound generally there is a small box placed at the center or heart of stupa this many contain bodily remains such as teeth bone or ashes of buddha or his followers or things they used this box known as retic casket was covered with earth later a layer of mud brick or baked brick was added on the top and then the dome like structure was sometimes covered with carved stone slabs often a path known as pradikshina path was led around the stupa devotees walked around the stupa in a clockwise direction as a mark of devotion how were stupas and temples built stupas and temples were the two prominent buildings found in ancient india apart from the temples the kings and the queens also built stupas there were several stages in buildings a stupa or a temple usually kings and queen decided to build these as it was expensive affair first good quality stone had to be found quarried and transported to placed that was often carefully chosen for the new building here these rough blocks of stone had to be shaped and carved into pillars and panels for walls floors and ceilings and then these had to be placed without mistake at right position king and queen probably spent money from their treasure to the craft persons who worked to build these splendid structures among the others who paid for decorations were farmers merchants garland makers perfumers smiths and hundreds of men and women who are only known by their names paintings ajanta this is a place where several caves were hollowed out of the hills over centuries most of these were monasteries for buddhist monks and some of them were decorated with paintings as the caves are dark inside most of these paintings were done in light of torches the colors which are vivid even after 1500 years were made up of plants and minerals the artists who created these splendid works of art remain unknown the world of books some of the best known epics were written during this period epics are also called itihas itihas is a record of facts of the past the first epic to emerge in hindi was ramcharitmanas of tulsidas based on the ramayana it is known as the great classic of hindi epic poetry and literature valmiki wrote the ramayana when rama was living with the five pandavas vyasa actually witnessed the various incidents narrated in the mahabharat or must have recalled the incidents as they took place through his mystic power a famous tamil epic silapadikaram was composed by a poet named lango around 1800 years ago it is the story of a merchant named kovalan who lived in puhar and fell in love with a courtesan named madhavi neglecting his wife kannagi later he and kannagi left puhar and went madurai where he was wrongly accused of theft by the court jeweler of the pandya king 
द किंग सेंटेंस्ड कोवलन टू डेथ कनगी हु स्टिल लव कोवलन वॉज फिल्ड विद एंगर बाय सींग दिस इनजस्टिस एंड डिस्ट्रॉयड द होल सिटी ऑफ मदुराई मैनी ऑफ अदर एपिक्स वर कंपोज लाइक मनी मेकलाई बाय सतनार मेघदूता बाय कालिदास एक्सेट्रा रिकॉर्डिंग एंड प्रिजर्विंग ओल्ड स्टोरीज अ नंबर ऑफ हिंदू रिलीजियस स्टोरीज दैट वर इन सर्क्युलेशन इन अर्लियर वर रिटर्न राउंड अराउंड द सेम टाइम दिस इंक्लूड द पुरानाज एंड मैनी मोर इम्पॉर्टेंट रिलीजियस बुक्स द पुरानाज कंटेन स्टोरीज अबाउट गॉड्स एंड गॉडेस सच एज विष्णु शिवा दुर्गा एंड पार्वती द पुरानाज वर रिटर्न इन सिंपल लैंग्वेजेस सो दैट एवरीबडी कैन अंडरस्टैंड इट दे वर प्रोबेबली रेसिटेड बाय प्रिस्ट इन टेम्पल्स टू संस्कृत एपिक्स लाइक महाभारता एंड रामायणा हैड बीन पॉप्युलर फॉर अ लॉन्ग टाइम द महाभारता इज बेस्ड ऑन द फाइट बिटवीन गौरवाज एंड पांडवाज हु वर कजेंस स्टोरी इज टोल्ड बाय ऑर्डिनरी पीपल ordinary people also told stories composed poems and songs sang dances and performed plays some of these arts are preserved in collection of stories such as the jatakas and panchatantra the panchatantra tales shared many stories in common with the buddhist jataka tales the panchatantra is an ancient indian collection of animal stories in verse and prose The original Sanskrit work was created by Vishnu Sharma which was later translated into many languages. The tales were based on earlier oral folk traditions. Some of these stories were passed on from generation to generation either in oral way or in written way. Stories from the Jatakas were often shown on the railings of stupas and in paintings in places such as ajanta so children these are some amazing facts about indian history that is depicted by buildings paintings and books that's all for today thank you everyone